Hello everybody, this is Dream Gamer back for another episode of Primal Carnage Extinction. This one's going to be a slightly different episode than usual because I want to talk about things that I hope to see get added or changed in this game. You know, in the, in the future. Because there is going to be quite a big update coming soon and I think it's actually coming this week. So I am very hyped for that and I'm sure you lot are very hyped for that as well and yeah just, I just want to talk about things that I would like to see changed so obviously the first thing let's uh, let's address the elephant in the room well there's many elephants to address in this room but let's address the major elephant in the room matchmaking so let's let's say for example we look at the teams here you look at this oh, oh, oh I'm gonna die <laughs> this is what I get for basically trying to commentate and play at the same time we have a teams there is no team shuffling because they stupidly removed it. So hopefully, and that is actually coming back. So that is one big positive change that's come in is the team shuffling is coming back. So the teams will get shuffled every round, which is awesome. And I don't know why they removed it in the first place, but you know, devs are devs. Dumb devs. <laughs> Next elephant to address in the room, Nova Raptor. And yes, Nova Raptor is getting nerfed. Yeah, boy. His hit detection is getting nerfed. I think even his attack speed is getting nerfed. They might have over nerfed it, but we'll have to find. We'll have to see. But yeah, it's needed a nerf because sod it. It's stupid. It's a stupid dinosaur. It, 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 it didn't need a nerf. You know, a lot of people were saying it was too easy to play. You just spam the left mouse click and you basically won. And even if that didn't work, you could just pounce and win, you know. It did need a nerf. Um, okay, yeah, so I'm sure some of you have seen online that the fly that the flyers are getting changed as well. The Tooper in particular getting a brand new secondary secondary attack, which I'm really looking forward to trying out. How will that Eh yeah, got him? <laughs> How will that sh shift the meta in this game? Well, will Tooper be top tier now? That's the thing. Will it be top tier? I don't think so. With the Tupa dive bomb attack, which is his new attack, I can I, I can see it going two ways. One, it's either going to be really OP and Tupa's going to be really OP to play. Or two, it's not really going to change anything and everyone will still avoid playing Tupa because it's stupid. I mean, I would like to see it get a little fixed tune-up as well because I, I just find Tupa just awkward to play. You get so many, like, it feels like there's so many bugs and such. Okay, so Next change, Ceratosaurus, and Ceratosaurus, in my opinion, does need a buff. Like, it might be an unpopular opinion, but it's my opinion. I do feel like, because of it, because it's much slower than the other bruises. Oh, hello. Hello, Sally. Ah, no! Yeah, I do feel like, because it's slower than the other bruises, it does die easier. And, and, well, the tail swipe is, in my opinion, the worst secondary attack in the game, as it stands, because it's just horrible it's horrendous like the damage is fine the the yeetage is fine it's just the fact that there's an off chance that your tail swipe could just randomly miss and that is just dumb i'm sorry it's dumb like who thought that was a good idea it's not a good idea it's a bad idea it's 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 just why are you doing this get lost ow get rid of the randomness but like if if you if, if if you want to just nerf the damage if you want if that's how it's gotta be nerf the damage and the yeetage i'd be fine with that as long as there's just not random chances of your hits not connect counting because that's just dumb i'm sorry it's i'm vent my rage holding back the rage here when i talk about it because it's just daft if you play Commando and you fire your rocket and it hits a dinosaur, that hit is going to count. That hit will count 100% of the time. Like, imagine if you f fired a rocket at a, at a dino and it did no damage. It's like, oh, 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 the dino, it missed. Get lost, you little shitbags. Oh, no, yeah, take that, Meta Raptor. <laughs> hey, hey, you too bad me, boy? You too bad me, boy? I'll teabag you back. This shit just got personal. Yeah, got him there. <laughs> yeah, have <laughs> Yeah, just no, 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 no. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's for a video. 
Right, back to what I was saying, now that, I, now that that guy died. All right, tyrants, I hear, are also getting a change because you will now be able to do your secondary attack while consuming humans. And that is quite a big change. And that is going to make tyrants a lot more prevalent now. So tyrants are going to be a major threat. And I also hear that you will still be able to run with the net gun on your face. So that is also a good change. Uh, well, not being a tire, I'll just be Novoraptor. I got a blue, I a blue Novoraptor. This is like the poor man's Thalassic Raptor. <laughs> but yeah, Tyrant's getting that chain, really good change. It's going to definitely shake, shake things up. I feel like Acro and Spino will benefit the most from it. I don't see Rex benefiting that much because, well, it's got unmissable hit detection for a start. Yeah. Yeah, it's got unmissable hit detection for a start, and the tail swipe is probably the weakest secondary attacker of the three tyrants. So yeah, Acro will probably be get benefit the most from it, then Spino, then Rex. Alright, now for some human stuff. So as as for the scientist, please fix the scope. Please fix the accuracy on the scope, because it's stupid and ridiculous. I know you could literally just adapt your aim to suit the scope's brokenness, but like you shouldn't have to do that. Like, because when they fit, do fix it, you've got to change it again. And it's a pain in the ass, especially when you're not as good as aiming as I am. This pyro is really annoying. Right, another change, and this one I've kind of gone off, changed my opinion on, is the AR. And while I have called for the AR to be nerfed numerous times, I kind of come round a bit. I would like to see you get a slight... Oh, poo. Attack anyway! <laughs> Ah, oh, you only have 5 HP. Yeah, I would like to see the AR get a tiny nerf. Make it a little less powerful in terms of damage output. Right, keep the rockets the same. Keep everything the same. Just nerf the, like, round the bullet damage. And and it would encourage the use of the other two weapons as well, which, well, the burst rifle sees a bit of play. The, the carbine sees no play. <laughs> like, it's, it's the discarded weapon. And it's... Like, it's not a bad gun, it's just severely outclassed by the other two, and that's why people use it, don't use it. It's, it's like you go to a sweet shop and you pick, you pick Harry Bows. Damn it! <laughs> you go to a sweet shop and you pick like, you see like two bags of Harry Bows and one's got more Harry Bows in it and one's got less, and they're the same price. You're gonna pick the one with more, aren't you? Duh, duh, duh. It's pretty pyros are annoying. <laughs> Yeah. Yes, I will be able to do that while moving. Instead of having to stop all the time, which is going to be very useful. Right, on to the Trapper. Now, I would like to see the Trapper get a slight nerf. Like, not to its main weapons, which I think are A-OK. -okay. Dude, this freaking Pyro is annihilating me. Like, look at the difference, like, between him and other Pyros. He's actually using the Flame Sword, and, like, 90% of Pyros don't. But yeah, on the trapper, I would like to see the stun gun get a buff. Not like a big buff. I'd like just like to see it get a range buff. And a new trick I, I come up with. Because I always come up with tricks. Ah, uh, there, there, there's an example. Freaking tail swipe deserted me. Please change it. Waste, Waste of bloody time. time. Waste, Waste of a game. game. Rubbish. So yeah, I, I would like to see the stun gun get a range buff. Which I think would make a good... Which would encourage people to play it more. Nerf the net gun's range, for crying out loud, because that thing sees way too much play. Although, I do think the net gun is getting a nerf, indirect nerf, so that's gonna be good. That's good. I would like to have it so that the stun gun can, like, have an AoE effect, which is basically an area of effect, I think, effect, when you shoot it in water. So it has an AoE effect on the dinos. So, say, for example, I shoot in this pool of water and there's, like, two dinosaurs. I can stun both those dinosaurs. Like, they don't have to necessarily stop moving, they just stun them. Like, a, like with a zap trap. And maybe do, like, less damage just to balance it out. But, yeah, I would I, that would be a really cool trick to have. One more thing I'd like to see changed. I'd like to see the Pathfinder get a buff. Not the double barrel or the, um... Not the double barrel, just the other shotguns. I'd like to see him get a slight buff. Whether that's with damage or accuracy. I don't know if it's just me. It just feels like the Pathfinder's other two guns are just underwhelming, in my opinion. Right, and, oh, oh, I died again. <laughs> That's about it. That's about it off the top of my head. So, yeah, big update coming. Really looking forward to it. Looking forward to all the changes and all the lovely content I will be doing. And that is basically why I've hardly done any Primal Carnage content on the channel. Well, on the main channel. I've done some short videos. 
And I still have a couple more of them to post. If I haven't posted them already. Which you guys seem to love. Especially the one with the rank 1 newbie gets the, the kilowatt spino. Like, honestly. My luck in this game is with ultimates is terrible. Like, I have been maxed up for over a year. Pretty much. I was one of the first players to max up his rank. I did not get a single ultimate drop. I'm not saying I should be entitled to it. I'm just saying. I'm just bad. I have bad luck. <laughs> and also on another note. The devs changed it. So when you evolved you were guaranteed an ultimate skin. Of course this was after I maxed up. So I missed out on like three ultimate skins. By basically playing the game. <laughs> so I feel screwed over here. And I don't like it. Oh, I died. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna end this session. That's a way to end it. So I hope you enjoyed. Uh, well, I hope you like enjoyed my giving me giving my thoughts on what I'd like to see in this game and things that I would like to see changed. And the upcoming update. I hope you're all stoked for the update because I agree. I sure am. It will hopefully get me back into making Primal Carnage content, and we will get get back to doing weekly content for this game. And until then, this is Stranger Gamer, signing out.